everybody, how are you? <laughs> nice to see you. Today we're going to do some Pilates for your legs, for strengthening the muscles of the legs. So, you will need a little cushion for today. If you've got one nearby, grab one. As always, be kind to your body, take it at your own pace. For those that don't know me, which I'm sure you all do, <laughs> I know Sandia, and I help individuals reduce their lower back pain without the use without relying on the medical professionals. So I think the medical professionals all have their space, but let's try to do something that we can do to help ourselves so we can feel empowered. Okay, so let's just take a moment to come onto our mats, or you don't need a mat, you just be on the floor, with your knees bent and the soles of the feet on the floor. And then take, maybe taking the hands to the hips and just allowing those hips to come forward slightly, so you arch a little through your back. Maybe take actually the hands behind the back so you can see that gap making. And then draw the stomach in, squeeze the buttocks slightly as you lower your back into the mat. So you're arching the back away, tilting through the pelvis in one direction, and then draw the stomach back towards you, squeeze the buttocks slightly. So you're mobilizing through your pelvis. One direction and the other. And one direction, and the other. Good, release it. Okay, so let's take our cushion and we'll place that in between our knees. And then we're gonna, it's a very small bit, we're gonna draw the legs in towards each other. So we're squeezing our knees in towards each other and then releasing. So we're squeezing and releasing. At all times our shoulders are down away from the ears. Jaw is released. Squeeze the knees together and release. So this helps us straighten through the inner legs, the insides of the legs. Squeezing and releasing. Squeeze and release. Squeeze and release. And then squeeze and hold. Two, three, four, five, Six and release. And again, squeeze, hold. Two, three, four, five, six and release. And once more, hold. Two, three, four, five, six and release. Good job. Okay, placing the cushion to the side. So now we're going to do toe heel with our feet. So we're lifting the heels off the floor, lowering the heels, and then lifting the toes up. So the heels left and the toes left. Heels and toes. So coming from heel to toe. Heel to toe. So you could just stay at that pace, that might be enough. So this begins to work the muscles of the lower leg. So if you can, so you can come faster with that. So toe, heel, toe, heel. So here, so here, keep going. Also, this helps to strengthen through the ankles. So, helping us, particularly if we're getting older as well, helping us with our balance, keeping those ankle muscles strong. So, rest if you need to. If you feel the back's jaunting with both legs, perhaps do one foot at a time. Otherwise, if it feels okay, both legs together, toe, heel, toe, heel. It looks easy, it is tough. Those calves get working, the lower legs out to the shins. Keep going if you can. Toe, heel, toe, heel, toe, heel. And release, oh, shaking one leg and the other. Okay, taking your cushion again between your knees and then coming into the squeezes again. So we're squeezing the legs together and releasing. Squeeze the knees together and releasing. Eight and seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, and hold. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and release. And again, squeeze, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. And once we'll squeeze, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and release. Good, and 
base of the cushion to the side. This time bring your feet together, your knees together. And then taking the toes out, and then the heels join. The toes out, and then the heels. Toes and heels. So we're working on leg muscles here, and also we're working through mobilising through the hips. Heels together, heels towards each other, and then toes. Heels and toes. So we're sitting side in the feet. So we'll come this way just so you can see. So the heels come out and then the toes. Heels and toes. Heels and toes. And the other way. Toes and heels. Toes and heels. Toes and heels. Then heels out, toes out. Heels out, toes out. Toes in, heels in. Toes in, heels in. So you're coming out and then in. Good. Then coming back so your knees are in alignment with your hips. We're going to come into the toe heels again. We're going to come here so you can see. So the toes can come onto the balls of the feet and then the heels. Balls and the heels. But I'm going to say toes heels. It's a little bit easier to say it. Toe heel, toe heel, toe heel. See if you can go faster. Remember if the back hurts, go one foot at a time. We'll just skip this one then. Toe heel, toe heel, toe heel. If it hurts the back, we can come into zigzags again. Ooh, feel those lower legs working. <laughs> ah, I'm releasing. Okay, once more with the legs, the cushion between the knees, feet on the floor, squeeze the legs together and release it. Squeeze the knees together and release it. And then squeeze holds. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release. And again, squeeze. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release. And once more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And release. Allowing the soles of the feet to come towards each other as the knees open out, stretching through the inner legs. Now if this is uncomfortable, extend the feet further away. If you need more stretch, bring your feet closer towards you. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. A deep breath in and a deep breath out. Draw the knees back in, one leg reaching up. And then rotating out through the ankle in one direction and the other. And draw the toes back towards you, stretching out through the back of the legs. And release the other side, reaching up, circling in one direction. Oh, here we're clicky ankles. And the other. I used to be a dancer. <laughs> I had a dancer come to Pilates once, she said, oh. All that stuff, clicky ankles. <laughs> Maybe it's that, I don't know. And then draw the toes back towards you, stretching out through the back of the calves, breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in and breathing out and releasing. Well done, everybody. Thank you for watching. If you've watched this and you've done it or haven't done it, comment below. If you're watching on a replay, I'd love for you to comment. Don't forget, we've got our free five days of Pilates and relaxation, which is starting on Monday. So if you haven't seen that already, um, have a look on the page, on the lower back pain, pain page, and you'll see it on there. We would love, love, love to have you. It's mainly on Facebook. You'll get email notifications reminding you to go in every day. If you want to also sign up for WhatsApp notifications, just to remind you when I'm going live. I would love to have you um, in that challenge. If you feel it's different, aching, and want to just get moving again, reduce those aches and pains, that would be the challenge for you. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>